So we are looking at team of the season to Liska. High, low, six foot three, left footed, four star, weak foot, five star skill. Can play cam, centre forward, or striker. And just look how crazy this card looks. 96 acceleration, 86 sprint speed, 94 finishing with 97 shot power, 88 composure, really good passing as well, fantastic agility and balance. In terms of traits, he's got some of the best traits in the game with finesse shot outside the foot shot. We have gone for a Hawk today and really just to boost those stats that we need, we still here a foot bin, gives him 99 acceleration, 90 sprint speed, gives him 99 shot power, 98 finishing, as well as boosting up that jump in strength and aggression. We'll look a bit more into Kemp Styles' price and what thought about the car, best position, and much more at the end of the review on Footbin. But that being said, let's go jump into some gameplay, but have a word from today's sponsor first. Are you tired of playing sweat teams like this? Make sure you go to Alt Knight, select Foot, select Foot 23 coins, choose which console and how many coins you'd like to buy, select your payment method, and don't forget to add code NANIC for 6% off on all orders. So we are playing in foot champs and we are going to be playing in our four triple two system with Talisca playing up front on the left hand side. His main job is to get goals, also see what his ability is on and off the ball, how he feels in certain scenarios and of course his link up play. He's on the ball already. Oh my God, he feels absolutely rapid when it comes to doing animation of skill moves. I've got Talisca already peeling. Good touch, gets round him. Long range shot and a great start already from Talisca. I tried to green time it and mess it up. And I can tell you right now, his animation is very quick on skill moves. So if you do like to use skill moves, he could be right up your street for you there. Let's get a pass off. Little link up. We've got Telesco in between the lines. Love your skill. Right foot finish, top net. And this card, left foot or right foot, doesn't seem to be a problem already. And it looks like we're going to be getting a rage quit in our first game. Let's see if he does go. He has gone. So let's go jump into a second game. So into our second game then. Quick, bit too early to judge on the card just yet, but I can tell you right now with the skill moves and the way he bursts into full speed, feels very, very responsive. He had two shots in that game with two goals, so his finishing looks really, really good, but that's down to his high finishing, of course, but as well as having really high shot power. So that means when he does get through into situations, he's going to have that. So we do get him here. Reverse Elastico nearly pulled that off. You can see that playing him even as a cam is going to be ridiculous. He could definitely play out wide if you need him to. And of course, he's playing as our secondary and first striker in a two up front system that we're playing. So unfortunately, we've gone one nil down. Let's see if we can do the kickoff glitch with Taliska. Running in behind. It's a great ball. Can he win that header? Of course he can. Good header, that is. Keep us with the possession. Do we find him on the inside? Using that pace to get past. There's got to be a foul ref. No foul given there. Got Taliska. Taliska with a great finish. And there it is. Three shots, three goals of him. Back in the game now. One all. This card is so clinical up front, that is for sure. Talisca on the ball. Bit of Fanta Glow, get some space. Find Jarzinho. Back to Talisca. The reverse Elastico into the Elastico, sorry. Hold up the ball for a minute. Oh, I tried to play that pass into the space there. Very unlucky. But you can just see how responsive he is on the skill move. Let's get pressure on. Find Talisca in the space. Little layoff. Got him on the last man. Look at that pace of his. Little ball roll into the scoop if we can. Maybe not. Oh, that's a poor shot in the end. Bit of a tough game here. Our opponent is playing very, very well. Got Teleska pinning down the line again. He's just there every single time. So a little hill to hill into that great pass in. Pass across. And how have we not scored from there? Teleska making that space. Easy pass across. And Rivaldo has absolutely bottled that. Teleska does pick the ball up though. Right foot shot. Ah, it's gone wide. That's the first shot he's missed. Looks like our opponent could be rage quitting as well. We'll just see. So far, really, really impressed by Taliska. He is offering so much up front. Because of his big frame and having that really high acceleration, he's actually unbelievably quick because he takes a big strides while he's running. And it's just given us so many opportunities to get him behind. I am choking the game a little bit. I will be honest. I'm missing a few chances here and there. But overall, unbelievably impressed by this card. Taliska, a little layoff. We're going to overlap between the gap. We find it. To let's go. Good touch. Ball around the keeper. Goes for the shots. Blocked. Gets the rebound. And there's the goal. But you can see that first touch in between the line there. Just drove him straight into the space. Really quick on the ball roll. Should have probably scored the open goal. Got blocked. But we do get the rebound. And the goal has been coming. To let's go. Has been absolutely dangerous up front. Right, so that's the ball down the line. Got to let's go in the box. We find him. It's a lovely ball. Lovely turn. And a left footed outside the foot shot. What a touch in. Lovely turn away from the defender. 
outside the foot shot trick coming in there to get that goal near post. And he's got a hat trick for us. He scored five goals in his two games. We are playing in foot champs as well. Remember that. So it's not easiest opponents at the time. But we are absolutely dominating. He's making me look better than I am. That is for sure. Right, let's go counter attack. Taliska gets past him. Oh, it's a lovely tackle. We do get space now. And Goretzka has let us down. And that is half time. So far, really, really good with Taliska. Not noticing any problems at all with him apart from maybe his first touch if I wanted to be really picky. But he's opening up that space every single time. In front of goal, he's unbelievably clinical. And we are playing a very, very tough game. But Taliska has taken us through into where we need to be. So far, really, really impressed by this card. Let's go into the second half. Second half is underway. Let's see if we can get a couple more goals with Taliska and get this win. So we're driving through with him already. Or oh, I tried to ball roll past him there. Right, our opponent has scored back-to-back -back kickoff goals off my kickoff, which has been unbelievably frustrating. Lovely touch from Taliska again. Bit of skill, gets past the tackle. Can't get the pass off, though. We do keep the pressure on. Taliska wants it. Again, using that skill. One more. There's a pass to Ronaldo, who just doesn't want to react to the pass. That's a shame. That was a really nice pass across. Keeping that pressure on. Got Taliska through. One on one, bang, see you later. Mr. Clinical getting in front there. Now we've got the lead again. Like I said, it's a sum game. We're 5 4 ahead. Poe's going to make some changes here. Taliska's been unbelievably good up front for us, carrying us through this game at the minute. Whether he's getting the assists or getting the goals and causing the space, he's just got it all in his locker. In front of the goal, he really does not miss. Let's go, Taliska on the ball. Bit of skill. Trying to use that pace. Couldn't quite get past Kanai, but we do read it. Keeping the ball going. Nowhere to go. Nowhere to help. We do keep ourselves with the ball here. Plus one, plus two. Right foot. No, it's a poor shot there. That's so unlucky. Managed to bully our way through all the way. They're getting a bit of the jam there. But we should have maybe had that shot on target. Minute. So let's go on the inset. It's got R9. It's got Alwaran at the bottom. So we're going to use Alwaran. Back to Taliska. One bit of skill to get pass. Lovely cutting pass. R9 again. Can't get the shot off. Good. Taliska wins that ball back. It's a good pass in. Skill. See you later. Finish. Bang. Mr. Clutch. This is unbelievable good, lads. Make sure you go get him. If you're packing from the guarantee that you're packing from doing league SBCs or whatever pack you get him from, you are so lucky. He is a super sub of dreams if you can't get him in your starting team. And he can just get that space like he can. In front of goal, he's unbelievably clinical. But Taliska here. Oh, he's giving us the space. Left foot, bang. Seven goals. Six of them have come from Taliska. 7-5 win in foot champs. It's been an unbelievably hard game as well. Real dodgy defending at times from myself. Managed to get ourselves a lead here. And no one but to thank there. But for the man himself winning the ball. Driving through. He's got himself an option at the top. Finds the RB. The RB's going to take a shot. Bang. An assist as well. And that just shows you how good he is in that one movement alone. He wins a tackle. He gets assists. He will win you the game if you need him. Do think we've seen enough gameplay. Let's go jump onto Footbin now. So we are on Footbin and his price is already dropping since I bought him. I bought him for like 850. I think he's around 750 now. He is dropping. We went for a hawk on him just to maximize those statistics that we wanted to with his pace, his shooting. And this card was so, so good. As a super sub, someone starting in your team or even just to have a bit of fun and fever. He's so, so clinical with this high lean body type and having 99 agility and 86 balance for somebody that's six foot three. He feels like a five foot five prime Messi or Neymar, etc. in dribbling. He's so, so clinical as well, as you saw, finishing almost every single chance that we had, giving us so many opportunities in front of goal. And generally, this is one of the most fun and clinical cards that I've used in FIFA in a long, long time. He offered so much in terms of going forward. You could play him out wide if you need to. We could play him as a cab. We could play him as a number two striker or a number one. Overall, an unbelievably clinical card. I think his price is going to keep coming down, to be honest. It depends on the pat weight. Of course, we've got the guaranteed SBC that's coming out as well in a couple of days. So who knows what he actually goes for in terms of prize. Imagine four or 500k is where he sits. But as always, if you have any questions about this card or any other card, please comment down below. If you're new to the channel, hit that like button, subscribe. I'll catch you in the next one. See you.